Hello everyone, Damien here from DK Bricks Theater. Today, we'll be taking a look at my Knights of Friendship from Star Wars Episode 9, The Rise of Skywalker. So, here we are, and here she... Well, before I even say that, let's take a look at... Let's let that intro roll. Because that's how things work on this channel. I forgot. So, let's let that intro roll, and then we'll get... Then we'll take a look at this model, shall we? What? So here we are, and here she is, the Knights of Renship. So, let's take a look at this ship, shall we? Let's. Well, before we even do that, please turn hit hit that subscribe button. That'd be greatly appreciated. That uh hit uh and turn notifications. You don't want to miss what we're doing later in the year. We'll be doing Transformers, Star War, uh, more wrapping up Star Wars, Star Trek, a uh, whole bunch of other things this year. So hit that subscribe button, and you do not want to miss it. Your recommendations might actually become future products. So, uh, yeah. It might become a future uh, video on this on this channel. So, yeah. Like I said, don't want to miss it. So, yeah. Let's do this. So, here's the Knights of Friendship. Which, I think I did a really good job uh, replicating here. It actually looks really cool. So, uh, yeah. We have the little grill. We have a little bit of a grill section here because there was a bit of a grill on the front of this ship. Uh, we have a nice slope going along on the back here. Nice little commandish area here. Uh, sonar. Turrets. Uh, heavy turret. Medium turret. There's supposed to be like a mini, a mini sized turret, like a like a miniature, like a like a light turret here. Like somewhere along this side, but I wasn't able to attack, build that because you know it's like all along this thing, so it's like, eh. <sighs> was able to build that one on here at least. Uh, this guy and these, uh, more like just techie detailing along here. We have a little bit of a slope going on here. Big engines on the back, as you can see there. Those look like those are some big meaty engines. Uh, thrusters here. And yeah, uh, I feel like I did a really good job with this ship. This ship looks really cool. I'm not going to lie. And I will say, I did like, even though the Knights of Ren were mostly just standing there and walking around in the movie, they did do stuff. Like, without them, the team wouldn't have uh, Ray and the crew, uh, along, Bray, Poe, and Finn wouldn't have, wouldn't have had to have gone to Basana, uh, wouldn't have had to have gone from Basana to Kajimi. Because Chewie wouldn't have been captured, and then if they didn't have to go to Kajimi, they wouldn't have had to have gone to the shuttle ship. Ray wouldn't have had to have wouldn't have known that she was a Palpatine. She like they she wouldn't have uh, like the Knights of Ren were pretty much on her tail. Were on their like, like pretty much made, helped move the plot along the way along in the way it was. And help set off events in the movie, so they were integral to the part of the to the plot of the story. I feel, which I do like. I did like that. Uh, so yeah. I say this ship was nice. Um, one thing that did get me a bit was this little bit of a slopage area here. This did bug me a bit. I was trying to figure out how to make it look right, yet you know make it work, and I think I did a good job of it. I think I made it work. It looks right, you know. As you can see here, we got a little bit of slopage on the back here as well. <laughs> on the back of the ship. So yeah, I'm just gonna give you some views. Here's a good bottom view, good top view, back view, back view. This is a nice build. I'm not gonna lie. But uh, yeah, we should also kind of cover the turns while we're here. This feller, nope, not that one. Can rotate freely. And this thing can up rotate, you know, pretty much that far back. 
So yeah, these guys, you could rotate them, but it's kind of, would be, they'd be bumping into each other. But they can go up and down. So, you know, you can, you know. As you can see here, it's going to bump into each other, so yeah. But if we did something like this, where... Something like that, that could work, but again, you know... It... It it works. The disc doesn't really can't really rotate because these are making it preventing it from rotating. But I mean, hey, it's whatever. It's just how it was designed and built. So yeah, I think that's pretty much it. So yeah, this is Damian from DK Brick Studios. Signing out. Please remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Turn on notifications. Check out my friend's novel, Rise. Link to that is in the description down below as well. Check out my socials. Link to those are in the description down below as well. Comment down below what models you'd like to see in the future. That'd be greatly appreciated. Hit that subscribe button. Turn on notifications. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. That'd be greatly appreciated. And uh, my Patreon is linked in the description down below. If you would love to, hit, love to donate, that'd be greatly appreciated. And, uh, yeah, this is Damien from DK Brick Studios signing off. And remember, you're the fourth and the fourth of us. Do if you always, and I'll see you all in the next video. Trust in your feelings and find a new hope. Take your best shot and let go.